It's our second day here and today we'll be exploring the temple site of Hampi which is declared as a World Heritage Site by UNESCO. My name is Reshma and welcome back to my channel. Hope you have liked the last video where we explored Hippie Islands. If you have not watched, you can access it by going to the link which I have pinned it in the comment section. Let's start exploring Hampi. Hampi was the capital of Vijayanagara Empire in the 14th century. We started our day by climbing Madanka Hill to see the sunrise which is close to the Hampi Bazaar. dark it might get difficult to reach to the top and also don't forget to carry water we enjoyed a 360 degree view of hampi from here and headed to meet lakshmi when i started to search in google for must do things in hampi lakshmi's name was there on everyone's list she comes for her royal bath on every day morning around 9 in tungabhadra river Remaining time she will be at Virupaksha temple. Though seeing elephants are not a big deal for me, a well-trained elephant who blesses you when you hand over some pennies was unusual. She is a true celebrity here and a photo with Lakshmi blessing with her trunk is in everyone's bucket list. While we were at the banks of Tungabhadra river, we saw this. We were a bit confused why she was stepping over the elephant poop. I tried to ask this lady but she was explaining in Kannada and we couldn't understand what it is. We went for breakfast straight from there and had amazing Israeli breakfast at one of the cafes. In Hampi, you, ne you need not worry about food. It will be of the best quality and taste. You can explore here the local food like dosha, thali, as well as continental foods also. Hampi's ruins are spread over around 4100 hectares. Exploring the monuments of Hampi in one day can be done only in your dreams. As this was our last day in Hampi, we hired a share auto which costed us around 600 rupees to take us only to the main attractions. It was a temple run for us. I will quickly take you through the important monuments to visit. Vitala Temple is one of the grandest and magnificent temple in Hampi. Here there are gorgeous stone structures such as stone chariot and musical pillars. We can actually hear the musical notes if we tap these musical pillars gently. I hope you remember this stone chariot which has made its way to the Indian currency note. Can you re recollect which denomination this is featured into? Sanana enclosure was reserved specially for the royal ladies of Vijayanagara Empire. Inside Sanana enclosure we can see Lotus Mahal. It is one of the most beautiful Indo-Islamic structure. During those times it was only accessible for ladies. No males were allowed inside except the king. But now it's open to boys, girls and all genders alike. There are three watchtowers like this in here, which is said to be guarded by Unix. This rectangular structure is said to be the base of Queen's Palace. But now the palace is completely missing or is ruined. It is the largest palace base excavated in Hampi ruins so far. These dome-shaped structures near to Zenana enclosure were the home for the royal elephants. Some archaeologists believe Sanana enclosure was not at all an area for royal women, but it is for the king to hold council meetings. We still do not know what is truth. We can also see the stepwell Queen's Bath near the Sanana enclosure. Mahanami Dibba is a rectangular stage-like platform which is believed that Vijayanagara king used to celebrate the Dasara festival. Here, there is an effigy of Narsimha sitting on seven-headed snake acting as a shelter to him. 
It is the largest statue in Hampi. This Shivalinga is carved out of a single boulder. It has a height of around 3 meter which stands in water. We missed out seeing and exploring many other monuments in Hampi. In Hampi, each stone has stories to tell you. I suggest you to spend at least 2 days in the temple side of the Hampi. You can rent a bike or cycle and can roam yourself instead of taking an auto tour. The weekend was over. It was time for us to return back to city life. But we will miss you Hampi. The temples, the ruins, the river, the empty roads, people we have met, everything. Thank you for having us here. Hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments below your suggestions or queries. And do not forget to subscribe the channel for future videos. Thank you for watching.